my name is Dave Lau. Uh, me of the City of Wong Park. This is my third term. I have been involved in politics for over for 20 years. You know, 10 years in, in the education, as a board of education in Garvey School District, three times as president of the board, and then also uh, 10 years in the city council. Uh, you know, three times as a mayor. And uh, I've uh, uh, involved in politics for total 20 years. And I also participate in the political uh, election or campaign six times. And uh, so I have a tremendous experience in, uh, in political uh, uh, campaign. And uh, my advice to the young people is that, you know, it's important that as a Chinese American, we need to really, you know, get involved, you know, in the mainstream, get involved in, in, in politics, you know. So, uh, so we should start young. And I think a lot of people ask me, hey, how do I, you know, I get elected to be a city council member or school board member? <coughs> My advice is this, you have to, you know, start from, from the bottom. You will start, you know, have the grassroots involvement. Number one, you have to, uh, you know, to get involved in the community, you know, for joy. You know, in school you join, you know, the, the, the student, you know, association, student clubs, you know. And then when, and then also when you, uh, you know, get out from school or when you are, you know, in college, then you get, you, you join a lot of service club, Lions club, you know, or the Optimus clubs all kind of clubs, and then also apply for commissions or committees in the city that you serve. And uh, so you got a lot of experience. You have also have a chance to meet the community leaders, to meet the uh, business leader, to meet the uh, elected officials, you know what I mean? And uh, that's important. Now, also, uh, I always think to get elected, it's not easy. It's actually the most difficult. However, even you got elected, when you want to be effective on the job, it's also more difficult. Okay? It's difficult to get elected. It's more difficult to be effective on the job as an official. Uh, so, I think uh, you have to start early and you have to pay your dues, you know, get involved in the community and get to know people. And uh, I uh, also, uh, in addition to serve 10 years in school board, 10 years in council, I also uh, join many of community organizations. You know, I think I join maybe, you know, over 20 service organizations as a board, the board of directors, the president of the board. In addition, I also serve as the uh, president of CEO, Chinese American official, twice. You know, the CEO, is uh, you know an organization with members from the elected official over for 50 members, including Judy Chu, Matt Fong, you know, uh, all those uh, people, in, uh, in as members, and uh, I also is a founding member and pioneer of this CEO, tiny Samberg elected officials, when it was first founded, with together with Judy Chu, you know, uh, Paul Z, Norman Xu as uh, uh, Sophie Wong and so on. So I, uh, I think uh, uh, I will encourage more of the young people to get involved in politics, to participate in politics, and then it's important that you, have, you need to have a voice in politics, you know, and then, then you can really you know, represent yourself, represent your people, represent your city and you can make a difference, you know. Uh, so I think for the Chinese uh, uh, American, in America, I think we, we have a lot of successful businessmen, we are successful professionals, but we still are underutilized in terms of pol politicians. We need more, you know, uh, you know, board member, we need more city council, city mayors, state assembly member, uh, you know, and also <coughs> the, uh, the congressman. Even we have a lot now compared to years ago, but we 
we still need more. So it's critical that we, you know, we have we need the young people. The future is in the hands of the young people. You, the young people, so you get involved, and then you can really help the China, help the Asian, help more people. And then another thing to get involved part is, you know, not only that you need to vote from the Chinese, you need to vote from, you know, the other mainstream people, you know. So you have to build consensus with other races. And also, uh, uh, it's also important that uh, you always go to support your local politicians, you know. When they campaign, you get involved, you know. And also, then you learn, you learn how to run campaign. Then you learn how, you know, then you, they become your mentors, right? So, there's a lot to learn, but I think we need new blood, we need you. You are our future, young people. So get involved, and I think then we will get more Chinese American, more Asian American in politics, like Judy Chu, like, you know, like a lot of appointments, you know, in different important roles, like ambassador of China and now Chinese, right? So I encourage all to get involved. Uh, and then also encourage people to vote. You you vote and not ask people to vote and then 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 there will be more people to vote. If the Chinese people, you know, got more vote more people vote, then you will become substantial uh, uh, voting power. Then you will draw the mainstream people with attention. Because other politicians Latino, white, and black, they look at how many votes you got, right? So it's important that we vote. A lot of Chinese don't care, you know, right? They say, well, well I don't care, I'm not, I don't, I'm not interested in politics. However, when something happened, <laughs> something happened to them, they say, oh, help me. So it's important to get involved, you know, in the political process.